What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Views. Bringing us a brand new touch and plays of the week. And this week we are 11 clips instead of 10. Just giving you guys an extra one. And I'm actually about to leave on Christmas break right now. So I'm recording this last minute. But I really want to put this video out for you guys because I promised you a top 10 this week. So yeah, I don't want to waste any more time. Let's just get right into it. At number 11, we got Sauce McAmar. And he's at the Pro AM. Gonna get the block. I think, yeah, you got the block. Come down the court with this team. And this is gonna break it and bang the jump over put back animation and the reason I call this the jump over animation is because your legs literally do that split so they can jump over your dude so perfectly and I feel like this one was made just for that and yeah this guy got it just in time to get it over his opponent at number 10 we got Lil Saint 35 and this clip y'all is again crazy just like the last one he submitted it was an ankle breaker but this one you're just gonna have to take a look at it but yeah let's go i'll break it down he gets the board long as hell look at it snatch back <laughs> cheese step back and then man that dude in the black he had to be a point guard based on his size and he still couldn't hold the 7-3 center but just look at the sauce man i'll play it back one more time this dude is literally doing point guard dribbles or just a nice ball handle in general, but he's a center doing this shit. That's why I put it in the top 10. And then he finishes it off with a nice spin finger roll. So guys, at number nine, we got D Zeng. And this clip is definitely on my top five for the worst ones I've seen so far. And let's, let's just look at it. So he's at practice doing that drill. I, I forgot which one it is. I think it's like the dead eye mid range one where you take contested mid-ranges and uh all you have to do is spot up to that red dot and bang him and you see you got that green light right there that one's green no doesn't go in whatever next one bricks it not green though uh another one green man that one goes in though two greens yeah, I thought that was it, honestly, but nope. Green. Again. Three misses that are greens simultaneously, and I really didn't think this was possible, and I'm pretty sure it shouldn't be. And with all the patches that 2K's had this year, there's literally been eight patches so far, if you guys didn't know. They still have not yet fixed OPS centers in the post. And the shirt kiosk and that's just a few to name i'm pretty sure you guys have your own list of stuff to fix but yeah three greens in a row is not okay 2k moving on to number eight we got v-man 10 rocks and this guy trust exponent gonna pass it out to el loco monster give it back to him size this guy up real quick do a quick momentum break him bye ankle breaker to spider-man i know this ankle breaker wasn't even all that but he still got his ass stumbling and then to drive afterwards and get the ma disgusting ass spider-man is the reason i put this in the top 10 and i have yet to get an ankle break to dunk and that's what i want the most so far in this game is to get that clip and actually i have the scotty pippen dunk i really want that one too but ankle breaker to dunk those are definitely going to be in the top 10 if you have them so send them in and if you guys don't know how to send in clips, I'll mention it at the end of the video. But yeah, good stuff, dude. So this next clip, y'all, I'm just gonna let you guys watch it because it has a crazy reaction and it's pretty funny, but it's at number seven by I Snag on Your Grandma. So just take a look at it. Oop, Catch me. Oop, oop. Alley, oop, oop, alley, oop, 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 alley. Oh, 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 the disgusting inbound windmill honey dip alley oop. I've seen this on putbacks, but never on an inbound alley oop, which is also why I put this in top 10. But his reaction is the main reason, and yeah, as you guys can tell, this guy was freaked out and probably the first time he got it too. So, this next clip at number six is probably the worst play you'll ever see in 2K history. And when I say that, it's not really dumb, it's just bad basketball in general i guess you could say i put a clip like this in the last year's top 10 i remember exactly and i'm pretty sure you guys 
don't know what I'm talking about, but just just look and tell me if you remember. So at the number six spot, we got Matthews Cuban, and he's gonna get that fast break windmill. But this next play, he's gonna be playing defense on this dude in the green jacket, pulling 420, and just look at it. Nope. 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 Finally gets the dunk after I think five tries or six. Six tries and they didn't even pass it out. They were just doing it like if it was gonna go in some way, but they finally got it actually and it was a dunk. But that uh I don't know dude. I feel like 2K should just like stop the play after that, but yeah, that was the first time I saw it this year and I had to put it in. So, I mean, at least it wasn't you who actually did that was our team, but I guess you could say good defense. I don't know. Coming in at number five, we actually got the same dude, Matthews Cuban. I just found out right now, but this team is going to play defense on this dude, but still face lit. But he's going to get the ball inbounded to him all by himself down the corner and just throw it up. Ma! He literally threw it so far, like past the side of the backboard, but still caught it somehow and then like bent his back or something and just banged it. And it was kind of in traffic too, not gonna lie. And also in that dude's face, I was trying to guard him. And to make it even worse, just a windmill bang. 360, man. But yeah, that was the first time I saw that. And let me know if you guys have got that or not. And actually on the same side too, because I feel like the side was like the best angle or place to get in general. At number four, we got Terrence, 1965. And he's a brown shirt, I don't know why, but gonna just be waiting in the paint for something to happen and patiently playing defense. Shot clock's not even winding down, but he's right there still. But then this dude on the orange is trying to windmill on him, but nope. Snap block without even trying, dude, I swear. Because if you really think about it, a windmill is going to be hard, right? And this dude just grabbed it like nothing and literally just palmed it, brought it down, and then just took it up the court by himself, too, and gets that and one finger roll to finish. So yeah, good stuff, dude. At number three spot, we got Born a Ball 691. And he's gonna get that steal on Kyrie. Snatch block. Ma! Tomahawk contact dunk on this dude. Just camping in the paint. And then he's just gonna play defense. But this guy's gonna get by him with the behind the back, which I highly suggest. And I'm actually gonna make a signature styles video soon. So for those asking, just be patient for me, please. I got you. I promise. But yeah, without the way, behind the back. Catch up to him, LeBron, ma! Swats out of bounds, and literally right before it was goal hitting too, because that thing was about to drop, and he came out of nowhere just like LeBron, and swatted that stuff way out of bounds. And also guys, just to mention, these clips are not in specific order, so whatever clip you want to be in number one, or you feel like a number one is, comment down below and let me know, because I actually want to know which one you thought is the best. And also, if you did make these clips, let me know so I can go subscribe to your channel and actually so other people can show some love too, not just me. So yeah, just be proud of your clips and just comment down below if you were in it. And if you didn't make it, then it's not a big deal because I promise you can make it if your clip is just rare or good and I haven't seen it. And I do look at all the clips. So yeah, without the way, number two, we got this dude Abrego at practice on the Spurs. And the clip at first, you can see that little split second. The dude was on the floor, so I kind of knew what this was already, but... He's just dribbling at the top of the key, patiently waiting for something to happen. And this dude's gonna be practicing, get that dunk on uh, Kawhi, I think. But nope. Bang! Step over animation. Harden. And then I thought that was a clip, y'all. So I was like, nah, it's not that special. It's nothing all that. But right after that, he's gonna go for the ball again. And drive again before this guy can get up. Ma! Just devastating windmill and drops him again. Like... Imagine if this happened to anyone, practice or not, I'd feel worse than any person who's ever got dunked on in the NBA or just in general. Back to back posters, he fell both times and there were disgusting ones too. So yeah, good stuff dude. Literally postering his teammates. So at the number one spot, we got Shift Ram playing good defense on this guy. So he's gonna get the board, pass it out to his boy, Ghost for me, I think. Get it, snatch back, bang, ankle breaker to contact dunk, and I've still yet to get this, but I promise you guys, I will, and when I do, it's going to be a nasty dunk, 
probably a Spider-Man, you never know, but it's gonna be a nasty dunk for sure, I promise. And yeah, just take a look at it again. The ankle breaker is literally on the opposite side, so we made it even cleaner. And then the distance too was crazy. He was like super far, but still managed to break him. And then he just had to drive, if you guys can tell. Open lane, literally like a airplane takeoff thing or whatever. Just a straight ahead opportunity for that poster, and he does it. So yeah, one more time, slow motion. Bang. Bang. Good stuff, dude. And yeah, guys, that's gonna be it for this video. Hope you all enjoyed, as always. And if you did make it to this week's top 10, don't worry, because there is always next week. And all you have to do is upload a clip to YouTube as unlisted and send that to my email at viewits10 at gmail.com. And I promise to look at all the clips, y'all. I actually looked at all the clips for this one, so there's no more. And I really think you guys can send me some ones that I haven't seen yet, because this game is crazy. And you honestly never know what could happen. So yeah, I hope you guys have a great New Year and Christmas with your family and stuff. And right when I get back from break, which should be like on the 3rd of January or something like that, I'm going to be live streaming every single day, or at least I'm going to try and also be uploading a lot. So make sure you have post notifications turned on and subscribe if you're new. And yeah, again, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one.